Since the late 1980s, the Soviet Army shifted its reliance from extensive multiple launch rocket systems MLRSs, to the BM-30 Smirch Whirlwind series for its long-range, battlefield rocket projection needs due to its cost-effectiveness and efficiency. Constructed on the chassis of the MAZ-543M, or MAZ-79111, series of 8x8-wheeled heavy military trucks, the Smirch featured a crew compartment positioned at the front left and a rear-mounted launcher unit capable of training, housing 12 300mm launch tubes. Its versatility allowed it to launch rockets with various warheads, including chemical types, leading to widespread adoption by Soviet-supported and aligned nations from Armenia to Venezuela. Even post the Soviet Union's dissolution, these vehicles were inherited by successor states, while the new Russian army maintained local models. Though its global usage has waned since its peak, the Smirch remains a valuable asset on the battlefield. As of 2015, Russia maintains a stockpile of over 100 systems, although it has been officially succeeded by the more modern 9A52-4 Tornado line. The Smirch series constitutes a complete weapon system comprising several critical components. The BM-9A52-2 serves as the core launch vehicle, weighing nearly 44 tons and measuring 12 meters long, 3 meters wide, and 3 meters high. Powered by a single V12D12A525A series diesel engine generating 525 horsepower, positioned at the front right side, the vehicle's hull is suspended across all eight wheels, facilitating cross-country mobility. It achieves road speeds of up to 37 miles per hour and can operate within a range of 530 miles. The launcher component of the BM-30 sits atop the rear section of the truck, equipped with traverse and elevation controls, enabling the vehicle to be oriented in any direction. The launch tubes are organized into three groups, two groups of four tubes each arranged opposite each other in a two-by-two -two layout, with the remaining tubes aligned in a single row atop the other eight tubes, allowing clearance for lift controls and support structures at the launcher pack space. Before firing, the vehicle must come to a complete stop and deploy its recoil legs. Positioned aft of the driver's compartment and over or between the first and second axles, the operating cabin for the launcher facilitates swift readiness for firing in three minutes and relocation in as little as two. The 12 rockets in its payload can be launched in 38 seconds, with reloading taking approximately 20 minutes. The TZM 9T234-2 serves as the reload vehicle and ammunition carrier, transporting 12 300mm rockets. The 1K123 Vivari designation applies to the accompanying command post, CP, component, while the PM-2-70 MTOV fulfills the role of the system's direct maintenance and support vehicle. The 9A52 designation encompasses the entire BM-30 series, which now includes the 9A52-4, a lighter weight model mounted on a Cam AZ-6350 series truck with interchangeable launcher packs for enhanced modularity. The 9A52-2T denotes the export variant of the Smirch, utilizing a Tatra T816 series truck chassis. Throughout its operational lifespan, the BM-30 has seen the development of various rocket projectiles beyond the standard 9M528 High Explosive Fragmentation HIFRAG, variant. These include cluster-based munition and mine dispensers, both anti-personnel and anti-tank, heat, high-explosive anti-tank, rockets, and thermobaric rockets. Despite its origins rooted in the Cold War era, the Smirch series saw its first combat deployment in 2014 during the Syrian Civil War, where government forces utilized it against rebel groups. Concurrently, Ukrainian government forces employed the system in offensives against Russian-backed rebels in eastern Ukraine. While the exact number of Syrian army BM-30s in service remains undisclosed, the Ukrainian army was reported to have possessed nearly 100 systems at one point. Pakistan locally manufactures the BM-30 under the designation A-100E at its Supako factory in Karachi, with 36 vehicles currently in service with the Pakistani army. India, a neighboring operator, boasts 42 9A52-2T models in active service.